Alrighty. Here we are. Day 51. And this morning I left camp at 6.05 a.m. And with by 6.10 I passed the sign that said the official halfway point. 1,090.5 miles. Swamp trail. Looks like a swamp as you can see. And current time 8.33 on a Wednesday. It is 4.20 2011. And uh I was a little bummed, really bummed, to have to miss 420, but uh, seeing that sign made it all worth it. The official halfway point on day 51. I'm exactly on schedule, if you count the fact that I was, you know, a quarter mile away from the halfway point last night then you could say I'm a quarter mile behind the time. Anyway, I was walking down from the shelter I stayed at last night, Tom's Run Shelters, and uh, seen this old guy out on a patio, and he said, hey, you want an egg -o waffle and some coffee? And I'm like, sure. Turns out that it's an actual hostel, and he's just a hiker going north southbound. So he told me about all this stuff coming up ahead and how flat it's going to be. As you can see, it's really flat. I have maybe one climb of about 700 feet today, and a couple little two, three hundred climbs. Nothing major. Uh, tomorrow, there's a couple rivers that are washed out. He said he was waist deep, and uh, so tomorrow could suck which I might do today. I'm kind of in a dilemma right now. I'm starting day 51, perfectly on track, and the only shelter is at like mile 18, and the next one is another 18 after that, which means if I want to stay in shelters, I have to go 36 miles today which is, uh, if the weather stayed like this, you know, they say it's supposed to warm up to 70 today, but there's supposed to be some wicked thunderstorms associated with that. Now, I don't really mind the thunderstorms as much as the rain, but if there's no rain with it, you know, I could very well just hike all day. You know, it's not about the distance necessarily anymore, especially when you have real flat terrain like this, with just minor bumps. I don't think I even break, well, I think I break 2,000 feet once today, and that should be right before the end of my day at the Alex Kennedy shelters. Um, Pennsylvania is weird because all the shelters have been like dually. So there'll be like two little shelters instead of one. And the old guy I was just talking to said it's probably because they do a lot of youth groups and urban outreach things. And so I don't really know. But it looks like I might be done with this road. Can't tell if I'm going to continue on or it's actually going to change directions up into the mountains finally. It might looks like there might be another road beyond that. But, it's a cool little river. Um, so yeah, like I said, here I am in Pennsylvania. And for the record, when I entered Pennsylvania, the I believe it was the day before yesterday, as I crossed the state line. That was the only state so far 
out of, this is now my seventh state, the only state where it wasn't raining as I crossed the border. Every other state, without fail, had been raining as I crossed the border. Now, that didn't last long, because it soon rained like hell. And as you can see, the trails just, this isn't even that bad compared to how it's been. But, uh, here we are, back in the jungle.